what the word is saying. Amen. Yeah, yeah. So I want to show you what the word is saying. Amen. Yeah, yeah. I did a lot of hoop in the beginning because I may not be able to do it. Because right. right. I want you to get this word. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma you are a group of people that are standing at the brink of something big. Wow. And what you really need to prepare yourselves for is the obedience and faithfulness yes. of your leader. Yes, yes. Amen. Now, some folks will tell you it don't take all that. But yes, it does. Because if it wasn't so, they wouldn't have been able to be led to the promised land. Yes, ma'am. They couldn't just go to the promised land. They had to be led to the promised land. There you go. Oh, y'all hearing me? And if you're not led, by a true man of God, oh. I tell you, get up under a real one because oh. you gotta be led to your promise. Oh. If you're not oh operating you in a good role of fellowship, you go. yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel the Holy Ghost. Yeah. If you're not following correctly. Oh. Oh. He hadn't talked to me, so I don't want to look over there. I don't want to look at the people that don't know. Me. Because I need to encourage you that you must follow closely. It's the little things that's going to make the, the big things come to fruition. Come on now. Are y'all hearing me? Yes, ma'am. It's the baby stuff like I need you to be over the children's ministry and children must be intact while I'm preaching. Uh huh. Uh -huh. wow. So who's going to do this without complaining? I need to wear it too. Oh God. Yeah. You got to fall in line because financially, God want to pour out some monies upon his people, but he can't do it with the people out of order. Oh oh what you talking about? We come to church, we clap, we praise God, but you know what? You know reality is when you go home. Yes, yes. Yeah, reality hits you in the face when you go home. Yes. And see, the thing is, you're not able all the time to just shout glory to God. Yeah. Right. You're not able to just shout, thank you, Jesus. Yeah. You understand me? Uh -huh. Because on your job, they will think you're going crazy. Yes, uh -huh. they will. They will say, you lost your mind, yeah. you're out of order, which you will be. Yeah. But I'm, I'm trying to tell you that when you come to the house of God, this is your opportunity yeah. so that when you praise him here, he can work things out there. Go to work in the Word of God. Oh, man. I just want to talk to you, okay? Yeah. So let's go to Ephesians, All right. the first chapter. All right. All right.